Good evening, mga mahal, my fellow gods, beloved. It's a nice, quiet evening. <laughs> Hallelujah. Oh, we praise the Lord and we glorify you, oh God. You are worthy of glory and honor and praise, Father. I am here again in my cozy room, going to read God's word tonight, Lord. As you are going to read God's word, oh Father God, help us, Lord, to understand and give us, Lord, the spirit of wisdom and revelation in the knowledge of you, oh Father God, as you are going to read your word. Hallelujah. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Thank you, Father. Oh, we praise the Lord and we glorify your Father. We acknowledge your presence in this place, Lord, in my room, Father. We acknowledge your presence. You are welcome, more than welcome. Yes, Lord, precious Holy Spirit, you are welcome in our midst. Holy Spirit is the greatest power in the world. Amen. His love is boundless. Jesus, the name above all names. Amen. Thank you, Father. Oh, we praise you, Lord, and we glorify you. Oh, God, thank you, Lord Jesus. Um, mga mahal, join me in reading God's word. And before that, I'm going to tell you a story. This will be my <laughs> uh, dinner tonight. This is actually the leftover from yesterday. My beloved sisters in the Lord came to say, came to see me, and uh, they brought some food. This is spaghetti, and also biko, and uh, we call it biko in our own dialects, and it's really yummy. And tonight I'm going to have that for dinner, and I'm not going to eat anymore. I had heavy uh, lunch, and of course I'm still too full actually. But I'm going to finish, otherwise it will become not nice for tomorrow again. It's no longer good. And so, tonight is the night that I'm going to finish this. And before that, of course, let's read God's word. The Bible says that Jesus answered and said, It is written, man shall not live by bread alone, but by every word that proceeds from the mouth of God. So it is so important for us to read God's word. Amen. Amen. And for the kingdom of God, it's not just eating and drinking, but righteousness and peace and joy in the Holy Spirit. Hallelujah. Oh, thank you, Father. We praise the Lord and we glorify you. Oh, God, you're worthy of glory and honor and praise. Father. Thank you. <laughs> oh, by the way, um, I'm going to tell a story about this. About the story about this <laughs> flower. Yesterday, you remember I made flower and uh, a vase, something like that. Here, it was here. And I brought it yesterday when we had dinner with my beloved sisters in the Lord. Oh, no. Lunch with our beloved sisters in the Lord. And as we had dinner, this, the flower that I made earlier on, toppled over, over because the wind was quite str strong. So it dropped. <laughs> Because it wasn't strong enough to hold. I was trying to put this side. I was trying to put this stone yesterday. But the mouth cannot go in to the... I cannot go into to, to the mouth of the bottle, which I had. See? It's that one. <laughs> it cannot go in. And so, so that it will become strong. And so, indeed, it went dropped yesterday. And, uh, and uh, as I was walking... <laughs> I went to buy grandma's uh, food and on my way I saw this one on my way I didn't even look for it it was just there alongside the road as I was walking and immediately I took this one and I bought it hallelujah and so thank you Lord indeed he granted the desire of my heart because as I was picking up the you know I was picking up the flowers i was praying like lord i pray that i have a vase to hold my flowers so that it won't drop and so indeed the lord provide here it is <laughs> to some more nice color i didn't look for it it was just there as i was walking and praise the lord for that and uh, i already made this morning as i was eating my breakfast early this morning i was making this one and 
And so, um, I was just thinking, oh God, Lord, please, if there is bigger than this one, so that's to cover up everything in there. And so, I went outside after my breakfast, after when grandparents are resting, I asked for permission again to go out, of course, to buy some things and of course to send my sister's money. And along the way, as I was walking again, I found this vase. And so, so look at that. Yay! The Lord grant the desire of my heart. <laughs> it looks nice, isn't it? Oh, thank you, Father. It's so good, Lord. It's so wonderful, Father. It's so awesome. You grant the desire of my heart. Oh, wow. Look at that. It looks like this one. <laughs> Look, the vase. Don't see? Just immerse. No, sorry. Look at that. Looks good, isn't it? Oh, thank you, Father. And also, this book is very special because at that time, I do not have money. And I wanted to 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 buy this book, so I just sat down to the to the bookstore, Christian bookstore, and read a portion of it. But I have to own this one, and so by God's grace, remember the seventy dollars which I have collected when I give my beloved Nanai money offering to the Lord, and someone grandma gave me. I gave that testimony earlier, uh, two days ago, I think, that grandma gave me an ampa because I cut her hair, and twenty dollars, and also my previous boss. Gave Gave me fifty dollars because I babysit here his his and her their <laughs> grandchild and so I had fifty dollars and so this book is actually only only fifteen dollars. Wow! I managed to have it. It is I've been reading on here. It's a, <laughs> it's a very nice reading. And so thank you, Lord. And look at that. The same as this one, isn't it? See. Uh, and by the way, this one also give give me by Jane, the lawyer, the sweet girl who gave the mooncake. Oh, by the way, this one also was the mooncake box that Jane gave last year to his to her grandparents. And look at that, it is a box of hummingbird, my favorite bird hummingbird. Hallelujah! Thank you, Jesus. And so I use this storage for my what for my hair band which was given to me also by my sisters in the lord this this hair bands and i'm collecting it i'm using this also for my hair it's a tab to my hair so that my hair will be neat and nice and so this is now the storage of my hair band this remember yesterday i i made this one the heart shape there and here and that one. <laughs> oh god that will be the storage of my hardships and perhaps all my pictures next time this photos <laughs> oh hallelujah god thank you so much you granted desire of my heart yesterday this purple and green my favorite color my beloved's favorite color as well look and the verse this morning god you're so good hallelujah indeed the blessing of god's favor hallelujah oh god i praise the lord and I glorify you, God. You know, when we just spend one minute with God, is it is it is as if in a, as a lifetime, you know? <laughs> oh, God, thank you. And what is the word today? If gratitude is a due from from children to their earthly parents, how much more is the gratitude of the great family of men due to our Father in heaven? Indeed, Amen. How much more? <laughs> wow, hallelujah. Oh, Father God, thank you, Lord. We praise you, Lord, and we glorify you, oh, God. Even little small amounts you gave, and this, this green uh, stone, which I wanted to put yesterday so that it will not topple over, uh, but couldn't go in. This has actually been given to me by students. They painted it, the students painted it, and it is came from... Uh, Happy Teacher is today, 2008, class 75 from Teacher Dorf, and there uh, is a student of section 7B, hallelujah, that children was so good. Oh, hallelujah, we praise you, Lord, and we glorify you, oh God, thank you all for all your goodness and mercy, indeed, will follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house forever, and by the way, that bold green one, <laughs> I was uh, playing in the rain, in my garden and uh, I was 
I was bathing, showering in the rain, and I saw that ball. Hallelujah. It's nice to play with that. Oh, God. Yes, oh God, Lord. It's so wonderful. Yes, Father God, Lord. You are the first and the last, the beginning and the end, the Alpha and the Omega. Hallelujah. Yes, Father. He was the first. Oh, yes. He was the last. Hallelujah. He was dead. But he came to life. Yes, Lord, you are alive forevermore. He knows our works. Let's be in faithful. He knows our poverty. We should endure. Yes, we should endure. He knows our tribulation. We should not fear. For no servant is greater than his master hallelujah he who has an ear let him hear what the spirit says to the churches he who overcomes if eternal life and he who is faithful receive the crown of life yes father as we are faithful to you lord yes we will receive the crown of life the incorruptible crown the crown of glory hallelujah we praise the lord and we glorify you oh god thank you lord for my beloved and i his worship song for you are the first and the last the beginning and the end the alpha and the omega it's a beautiful worship song and it's a prayer as well hallelujah oh we magnify you lord we glorify your father thank you for the cross the mighty cross lord thank you jesus oh hallelujah come mga mahal Let's continue on reading now God's word. We will be continue on reading now God's word in the book of Hallelujah. In the book of Joshua chapter Hallelujah. Thank you Lord. Joshua chapter 15. Yes. Hallelujah. Father God, as we read your word, help us to understand Lord. Give us the spirit of wisdom and revelation in the knowledge of you, oh Father. Again, as we continue to read your word, we already had prayed this earlier, but it's still good always to pray and acknowledge God before reading God's word because the Holy Spirit is our teacher. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father. The land given to the tribe of Judah. This is in Joshua chapter 15. The allotments for the clans of the tribe of Judah reached southward to the border of Edom as far south as the wilderness of Zin. Uh, the, south, the, southern, the southern boundary began at the south bay of the Dead Sea, ran south of Scorpion Pass, into the wilderness of Zin, and then went south Scottish Barnia to his ruin. Then it went up to Adar, where it turned toward Karka. From there it passed to Azmon until it finally reached the brook of Egypt, which it followed to the Mediterranean Sea. This was their southern boundary. The eastern boundary extended along the Dead Sea to the mouth of Jordan River. The north boundary began at the bay where the Jordan River empties into the Dead Sea, went up from there to Beth Hogla, then proceeded into Beth Araba to the stone of Buhan. Buhan was Reuben's son. From that point, it went through the valley of Akchor to the to Debir, turning north toward Gilgal, which is across from the slopes of Adum, Adumim on the south side of the valley. From there, the boundary extended to the springs of In Shemesh and onto Ingrel, In Rojel. The boundary then passed through the valley of Bin Hinnom along the southern slopes of the Jebusites, where the city of Jerusalem is located. Then it went west to the top of the mountain above the valley of Hinnom and on top and on up to the northern 
end of the valley of Rephaim. From there, the boundary extended from the top of the mountain to the spring at the waters of Niftoa, and from there to the towns of Mount Ephron. Then it turned toward Baala, that is Kiriath Jearim, the boundary circle which west of Baala to Mount Zeir, passed along the town of Gizalon on the southern slope of Mount Jearim and went down to Bismish and on the Tim Timna and on to Timna. The boundary went, then proceeded to the slope of the hill north of Ikron, where it turned toward Shikaron and Mount Baala. It passed Jabnil and ended at the Mediterranean Sea. The western boundary was the sea shoreline of the Mediterranean Sea. These are the boundaries for the clans of the tribe of Judah, the land given to Caleb. The Lord commanded Joshua to assign some of Judah's territory to Caleb, son of Jephoni. Thank you, Father. Let's carry on reading. Uh, so Caleb was given the town of Kerariath Arba, that is Hebron, which had been named after Anak's ancestor. Caleb drove out the three groups of Anakites, the descendants of she Shehai, Amihan, and Talmai, the sons of Anak. From there he went to fight against the people living in the town of Deber, formerly called Kiriath Sefer. Caleb said, I will give my daughter As Aksa in marriage to the one who attacks the captors of Kiriath Sefer. Othniel, the son of Caleb's brother, Kinaz, was the one who conquered it, so Aksa became Othniel's wife. Then Aksa married Othniel, Othniel, she urged him to ask her father for a field. As she got down of her donkey, Caleb asked her, What's the matter? And she said, Give me another gift. You have already given me land in the Nijib. Now please give me springs of water too. So Caleb gave her the upper and lower springs. The towns allotted to Judah. This was the homeland allocated to the clans to the tribe of Judah. The towns of Judah situated along the borders of Edom in the extreme south were Kabzil, Edor, jo Jagor, Kina, Dimuna, Adada, Ki Kiddish, Hazor, Isnan, Zif, Telem, Bialoth, Hazor, Hadata, Kariuth, Hezrun, that, he, that is Hazor, Amam, Shima, Mulada, Hazar, Gada, Hishmun, Bispelet, Hazar, Shual, Bersheba, Bizid, Sarthia, Baala, Aim, Izim, El Tulad, Kizal, Homra, Siklag, Madmana, Sansana, oh, I really do not know <laughs> how to read all these names, Libaos, Shohim, Ain, and Rimon, 29 towns with the surrounding villages. The following towns situated in the western foothill were also given to Judah, Ishtaol, Zorah, Ashna, Zanua, Inganim, Tapua, Enam, Jamos, Adulam, Soko, Izga, Zaharim, Edithaim, Gidira, and Gidurathaim, 14 towns with the surrounding villages. Also included were Zinan, Hadasha, Malgal, Migdalgad, Dalian, Misfi, Joksel, Lakish, Lashik, Boskath, Eglon, Kabun, Laman, Kithlish, Gideros, Abistagon, Naama, Makada, 16 towns with the surrounding villages. Besides this, there were Libna, Isa, Ashan, Ifta, Ashnan, Egypt, Kielam, Agzib and Marasha, nine towns with the surrounding villages, the territory of the tribe of Judah, mm, 
also included Ikron and its surrounding settlements and villages. From Ikron, the boundary extended west and included the towns in our Ashitud with the surrounding villages. It also included Ashitud with its surrounding settlements and villages and Gaza with its settlements and villages as far as the brook of Egypt along the coast of Mediterranean Sea. Judah also received the following towns in the hill country Shomai, Jatia, Soko, Dana, Kariath, Sana, that is Jibir, Anab, Istimo, Anim, Gushin, Holon, Gilo, eleven towns with the surrounding villages. Also included were towns of Arab, Duma, Ishan, Janim, Beth, Tapua, Ap Apika, Humta, Kiraias, Arba, that is Zebra, and Zio, or nine towns with the surrounding villages. Besides this, there were Maon, Kamel, Zif, Hota, Jishra, Jukdim, Zuana, Kain, Jiba, Tima, ten towns with the surrounding villages. In addition, there were Halhol, Bezizor, Gidon, Maaras, Bezanos, and Ixilkon, six towns with the surrounding villages. There were also Kiraias, Baal, that is Kiras, Jorim, and Rabba, two towns with the surrounding villages. In the wilderness, there were the towns of Bisrab, Araba, Midian, Sakaka, <laughs> Nibsan, the city of salt, and Gidir, six towns with the surrounding villages. But the tribe of Judah could not drive out the Jebusites who lived in the city of Jerusalem. So the Jebusites lived there among the people of Judah to this very day. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. So not all Israelites, there's some Jebusites as well. Hallelujah. Father God, thank you, Lord, for your word. Help us more to understand, Lord, as we continue, Lord, to uh, uh, think about it again, Lord, of what it is about in the book of Joshua. Father God, thank you, but this is where it always says that reminds us that I have not commanded you be strong and be, and be good, be of good courage. Do not be afraid, nor be dismayed, for the Lord your God with you wherever you go. Joshua verse, chapter 9 verse, chapter 1 verse 9, and that is a very strong thing that we can remember always. Father, thank you, Lord, for your time, for your time, Father, to... Lord, teach us about all these things. Thank you, mga mahal, for reading God's love letter with me. May the Lord bless you and keep you. May His face shine upon you and be gracious to you. And always remember that Jesus loves you. Good night. God bless and take care. Let's read again tomorrow. Bye. And remember, don't let the sun go down with anger in your heart. <laughs> Always remember that Jesus loves you. Good night.